tonight, thank God it's them instead of you. And there won't be snow in Africa this Christmas time. Man, that came out when I was, like, in the 80s when I was a kid. Remember Christmas break or winter break as they call it nowadays. I remember um, just getting all excited when that would come on the radio. <laughs> and our MTV, and I always cried because, like, Bananarama was crying in the video. But I always thought that was kind of weird that he says that. Like... Well, tonight, thank God it's him <laughs> instead of you. It's like, really? It's kind of... Anyways, um, that was my daily Christmas jingle. <laughs> Anywho, uh, okay, so this morning when I posted on Facebook, I had a goose egg. Um, but I went number two and... Um, <laughs> you know, laid back down about, I don't know, an hour and a half later, got up and um, weighed and I was actually a pound down. So I'm gonna take that, I'm gonna take that pound. Uh, it was 194, so. Uh, yesterday, what did I have? I had um, the, the Ensure bar that was I said lunch, but I, I didn't eat any breakfast. I had coffee in the morning, my vanilla skinny, and um, uh, a clementine. Um, oh, I had also bought these pecan delight. They're it's like a, that Stouffer's, I think. It's a sugar-free. I was having some like chocolatey, nutty cravings yesterday. Not that I'm hungry, just craving. Um, so I had I think one or two of those. And um, fudge sickle. <laughs> yesterday was a candy craving day for me. Um, and I think I also, I had, yeah, a jello pudding. So, and those were my snacks. I was just like, oh, trying to ate the whole box of vegetables, so, um, and then for dinner, I had steak, and, um, asparagus mushrooms, and, um, that's usually my staple, uh, veggie, is asparagus and mushrooms, green beans and mushrooms, um, bell pepper and mushrooms, broccoli and mushrooms, um, I love mushrooms and I love that I can eat them on protocol and they don't hold me back whatsoever. So uh, I didn't get all my water in and I just realized I forgot my gallon of water. But you know, I don't know, you guys might think I'm crazy, but the water that I bought yesterday in that gallon, I bought it because of the gallon. I liked it. It's, I like the handle and such, but the water was gross. Like... I mean, I have a preference in water, you know, I, I'm not a water snob, but I mean, this water was kind of gross to try to chug, so, I don't know, I, I blame it on that, but I have water at home that I usually fill up my jug in, so I can easily just do that, but, um, so anyways, so on my way to work this morning, um, I only work till two, and my sister works at the same salon that I do. We share a station. She works Thursday, Friday, and every other Saturday, and um, so that's why I was off yesterday, and I work in the morning on Fridays, and then she comes in in the afternoon and works till the evening, um, but she's coming in today, and we are, um, we are going to go to the costume shop. And, uh, um, get our yearly, annual Christmas costumes, Christmas through New Year's costume. Um, I usually some, have some kind of petticoat or big, you know, like square dancing looking petty skirts, they're called. Um, 
and there's this great shop that just has like amazing stuff in it so I usually find something um, so anywho uh, yeah that's about it um, not a lot to talk about Sergio McChicken McChicken spicy come on buddy <laughs> you saw that grilled chicken on the menu. You know you could have had that. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. Sucks that guys lose weight so much faster than we do. Like, all oh, their metabolisms are like rockets. And I'm sure on HCG it's like... <whistles> but, um... So, Amy, got some Christmas shopping online done. <sighs> um was pretty cold this morning. It was only supposed to be 30 something today, but the sun's out. There's not a cloud in the sky. And um, it's just going to be a gorgeous day for us Venetians. Um, so what else? I haven't had anything. I had a cup of coffee at home. I, I, ha I drink that egg log eggnog latte. Um, and I hasn't, it's not sugar free or anything, but it hasn't stalled me or anything, so, um, what else on a non-scale victory, I'm feeling very thin, that's why this morning the goose egg didn't, um, didn't really bother me, because I was like, what, I feel good, the jacket, my arms are loose in it, you know, this is my go-to jacket, this jacket I got at Kmart, for like 20 bucks or something, bargain. I mean, I haven't been to Kmart since I bought this. It was like a Black Friday thing. I went with my sister. She bought some TV for an insanely awesome amount of money. So, I mean, insanely low amount of money, I should have said. Um, but, uh, whoa, this guy just stepped on his brakes. Um, but yeah, I haven't been to Kmart since. <laughs> Uh, they're just a there's not one by me B I I mean I don't know anyway so yeah it's one of those Jacqueline Smith <laughs> and I work in Old Town Scottsdale which is um, kind of a fancy schmancy part of town and um, so these women go oh, that's such a great jacket oh my goodness where'd you get it they expect me to say Macy's or Nordy's, Nordstrom, yep, Kmart. I have a skirt too that I wear that I bought at Walgreens for two bucks and I'm always getting compliments on that. Where did you get that skirt? Oh my God, that skirt's so cool. Walgreens, what? Walgreens. Ah. No offense to everybody that's Midwesterners, but you guys come out here for the winter and it's like freaking drive so slow. If you haven't noticed, I have um, changed lanes like four times. It's just like, oh my God. Let's roll the boat, people. Keep it moving. And then the license plate usually says Minnesota or Canada. <laughs> I'm sorry you guys have snow and it's so cold that completely, totally bites. I mean, it's cold for us here, but I don't need to be standing outside for any reason. And I'm not shoveling snow or scraping it off of my windshield when I have somewhere to go. So, you know, it's one of those, uh, this is the reason why we live here and you guys are laughing at us because it's 150,000 degrees in July, but it's not really that bad. I'm a native. I've lived here my entire life, and um, uh, the older I got, the more whinier I got about how hot it was outside, but when we were kids, like, it totally didn't matter. We'd play games like, take your shoes off and run across the street before your feet burn off. <laughs> Although it would have been awesome to have an ice rink in my front yard, Chasm. That would have been really super cool, but I don't know. Anywho, so now I'm just rambling all this non-HCG business. Maybe. 
and um, have a fabulous Friday, folks. Ciao.